hi students uh, in this video I am going to explain about how to use transitions and how to use animations into your presentation so if you have a look here they said open your presentation that you saved in the previous task so you just need to apply the transition between all the slides in your presentation animate all the bullets on uh, slide 3 so that appear one at the same time so I will just click here and we'll move to slide 3 here I have these uh, bulleted points so when I click on it and click on uh, transition here so we have different kind of transitions when you click here so they all appear at once and then you can even apply other kind of uh, designs or other kind of methods that you can apply to them one by one and even as a whole as I have selected now so it is applied to the whole uh, text here which is in the bulleted point and then after we have animation effects as well so in animation effects they always mention for example open the presentation that we saved so it is already here only slide only the slides okay uh, presenter notes audience notes evidence of the transition between uh, slides and evidence of transition on slide 3 so what you need to do you just need to uh, start with the printing as well uh, I will tell you what you need to do in the printing but before this I would like to move with the transition for example here this one I will click on animation and then I will just uh, choose from here uh, from animation pan will choose uh, the text for example or like for example I choose this one so when I open the presentation this one will look like that so you can here uh, duration you can increase also at how long it will take for example now when you just have a preview so when it start uh, to show the slide it almost take 2.5 seconds to display then in the same way for example uh, this slide or this one we'll choose this one and fly in I use with it so you can see the transitions and animations are applied for example this chart so now the chart will appear like that so this is what we can do and then we come towards the printing so when you click on the print option here you sometime in the exam they ask you to print the presentation with the four or six slides per page eight slides per page so in this case you need to click on full page and then you choose for example six slides per page or you can just choose for example two slides per page or in case if they ask you to show with the presenter notes so you can click on notes page so those which have the presenter notes you will find them uh, at the bottom of the slide so this is what we have in this whole presentation part for the syllabus I hope you have learned all these tasks and you have to practice them so to learn more at the same time so thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe the channel for more videos and update thanks again